My name's Aaron Croman, and I'm going to show you how to erode text in Photoshop to kind of mangle it and look grungy like a, it's been weathered with time. Let's get to it. Okay, so we have our file, and we're going to use the uh, text tool. Ooh, that's pretty big, so I'm going to knock down the size a little. Uh, 30 should do. And type down that text, so a uh, good word to use. Let's use erode. And then hit the check mark. There we go. Okay, so now that we have uh, all this down, how do we erode it? Well, we could rasterize it and uh, then add a, an effect, you know, rasterize type. But I kind of want to preserve the text. So I'm going to go to the layer mask. And then I'm going to go over where the T is. And I'm going to hit Command or Control and click on it. And I get the selection area of the text. Now I'm going to go to Select inverse and that makes the selection area go everywhere outside of the text and I'm going to make sure it's selected on the uh, mask layer. You can see the little bars around it. You use a layer mask to block off parts of your picture that you'd rather not uh, erase or delete. Uh, that way you can just kind of uh, do different effects and make it look a little bit more interesting but without destroying it. Uh, if you select on the text layer, you can get the little bars around that, and now the text is selected. So we want it to be selected to the, to the mask. And uh, we're going to uh, use the paint bucket and fill it with black, and nothing happened. Well, not exactly. Actually, something did happen over here at the layer mask, and you can kind of see it right here, a little bit, but you can see it's black now, no longer white. So we're going to hit uh, Command or Control D to deselect the text, and uh, we still have it selected on our layer mask. We're going to go Filter, Brush Strokes, and then to Spatter. And now this br opens up our filter menu, and now you can see all the black part of, uh, of our layer mask and already kind of looks pretty eroded with the, just the settings uh, so far. And we have uh, little things like the spray radius. Uh, if we put it at zero, it just stays normal. But at 25, well, it's, you can't even tell what it is. So I think I'm just going to go with a happy medium, uh, around 10 or 11. And then smoothness, uh, if you go no smoothness, it gets all over the place. Uh, kind of almost like it's blurry, but if you use a lot of smoothness and you almost can't see the, uh, the any of this spray radius, the etch, the erosion into the letters. So just kind of go equal down the middle, so about seven, and then hit OK. And the letters are eroded. Now the cool part about it is you can uh, about using a mask rather than uh, than rasterizing the text is you can still edit the text. Uh, you, you can still do stuff with it and you can always disable the layer mask if you don't like it. Uh, you right click on the layer mask and enable or disable. And uh, that's how you erode text in Photoshop. My name's Aaron Croman, and good luck with your art.